Hola, my name is Catalina Cáceres, Miss Earth Chile 2014. My country has very interesting facts. For instance, although it has a very small territory, Chile is among the longest countries in the world. It runs along the Andes Mountains from which it takes a dramatic and taintable landscape of volcanoes. It has also an impressive mixture of deserts, forests, lakes and of course beautiful beaches. What makes me really proud of my country is that we are South America's most stable and prosperous nation. We lead in rankings of human development, competitiveness, income per capita, globalization, state of peace, economic freedom, low perception of corruption, sustainability of the state, and democratic development. Chile is also a founding member of the United Nations. Music, reading, and acting are my passions. I'm not a very good singer, but I love attending to concerts and enjoy good Chilean music. Reading relaxes me and sometimes it helps me to get sleep. Acting is something that I really love because the stage is a comforting place for me. When I'm not studying to become an industrial designer, I work as a part-time model. I also love outdoor activities and that's what makes me really happy because this year's Miss Earth Advocacy is ecotourism and I believe that I have a lot of knowledge in that area. The project that I'm supporting is called Promoting the Principles of Ecotourism and as the name says, the idea is to visit different ecotourism points of my country and help them with promotion in our Miss Earth Chile organization social networks using my platform as an environmental ambassador. The idea is to explain to our followers what is the meaning of ecotourism and invite them to follow these five principles. Minimize impact, build environmental and cultural awareness and respect, provide positive experiences for both visitors and hosts, provide direct and financial benefits for conservation, provide financial benefits and empowerment for local people. My first ecotourism stop was at the first Chilean glamping called Ruka Pop Up. It's located one hour from Santiago. We choose this project because it's new and they need our help in promotion and also because it respects every single principle of ecotourism. I spoke with the director of that amazing project and told him about what we wanted to do in social networks and we offered help in every single aspect they could need us. Once there, I realized that they needed hands with the installation So I applied all my knowledge as an industrial designer and offered my help organizing the interiors of the rucas. Before knowing this year advocacy for ecotourism, I worked on a project called The Face of the Earth and it consisted in attending to Feia Verde as a role model for expositors and children. That experience was amazing because I had the chance to feel the essence of the people who want to really make a change in this world. I also had my stand where I spoke about environmental education and how to minimize impact. It's important for me to say that my interest in our environment started a long time ago, before becoming Miss Earth Chile. It's because of the relevance of this beauty pageant that I was willing to enter in it. It's a challenge for me because I would like to prove that I could be a good Earth Ambassador. It's my dream to travel around the world promoting the real meaning of being a Miss Earth, encouraging girls to participate in their country's national pageant. I would use all my knowledge to help people understand how they can take care of our planet and I will make a big effort in making ecotourism something that every country should support. So let's make it happen. I am Catalina Gases, Miss Earth TV. I am a woman of the earth.